You're watching a chilly edition of Shaw Arts and Entertainment. I am Curtis Anderson. I'm out at the John G. Diefenbaker Airport today alongside the five guys of Low Level Flight. Just drove into Saskatoon in their awesome A-Team van. You can yeah. see over there the A-Team van. Get a shot of that. Oh, yeah. Guys, <laughs> big gig tonight. You're playing at the Roxy on Broadway. You're shivering already, sir. Um, I'm sorry. We can dance around no, if you want to try to keep here. warm a bit. Uh, first of all, thoughts as you drove into Saskatoon. You yourself, Ryan Malcolm, no stranger to Saskatoon. You've no, been here yeah. before. I've been here before. I mean, we loved it. We just came in from Regina, so it was... Uh, you know, to step up. It's like it, going, for, I, it like going from coach to first class. For sure, man. We love it. I mean, I've been to the airport a lot, mm -hmm. for sure. And uh, actually, James and I were just mentioning that this is like the one airport that we remember on the last promo trip we did. And I think we hit about 10 airports. So it's very flat. Yes, very, yeah. very flat. All right, I'm going to go over to the three over here. Uh, sorry, I got to do some textbook reporting here. How did you guys get together, and why did you call your band this name? Well. It kind of uh, happened um, through MySpace. Ryan was looking for a band kind of a thing, and he hit up some dudes, and it slowly came together as Low Level Flight, as you know it right now. Yeah. Why Low Level Flight? <laughs> ah, that's actually, um, it is a lyric from one of the songs that didn't actually... Uh, <laughs> make the record. Make, make the, the record, yeah. yeah. Stuff. One of the crappy songs. Yeah. yeah. Okay. James wrote it. Yeah, <laughs> cool, cool uh, name, but we didn't use it for the the album. And now you've been on tour for about a month. You have about five days left. So kind of the tail end of the tour. Thoughts so far on the uh, 07 tour? Uh, well, it's been great. Um, we've had a lot of fun. Played a lot of cool places. You grew a mustache. I grew a stash, a stash. Uh, which my wife's not gonna like, okay. but um, I love it. Uh, yeah, Canada, man, it's great. We we drove the country, and uh, it's been fun. And we went from mountains to uh, prairie in a matter of days. It's awesome. Yeah. Are you, I grew oh. something too. I grew a hemorrhite. Oh, oh. fantastic. Yes. That's uh, that that brings the interview to a brick wall. But we're just gonna plow through that. Okay, this is kind of cool. I, again, I took some quick jot notes off the net right before I came here. You, you formed your own label, I Heart Records, is yeah. that correct? Yes, uh, about uh, eight months ago I started up the label and um, it was just sort of just a decision between myself and uh, my business manager, Mike Rosenberg. And uh, it was just, uh, you know, wanting more control with the music and um, you know, having the ownership on myself as opposed to somebody else writing the stuff for me and, and that sort of thing. So it was a pretty easy decision for me. I'm getting like shivering in stereo uh, from both yeah. sides. Okay, the first album, the first CD, Urgency, doing very, very well. Yeah. One song uh, was number one for like 14 weeks. Yeah, our video for Change For Me uh, went straight to number one, which is really exciting for us. It was our first video and uh, actually the only, only the second video I've ever done. So uh, for us to get that was really cool. And uh, we're actually on our way back to Toronto in about five days to shoot the next video for the second single, which is Say, which I believe is uh, probably going to start getting radio play in Saskatoon tomorrow. Cool. Describe your sound. Uh, I was doing a little bit of reading here. Holiday. A little political as well. You guys got a little mixture of everything? Yeah. it's. Um, <clears throat> Ryan likes to bleed his heart out about his heart. Thing, uh, <laughs> things that are going on in the world and stuff. He's a very emotional person, and he likes to let that out in his lyrics. Uh, reaction to you guys been really good so far? Yeah, oh, for sure. It's uh, no uh, real booze, no. not really. Yeah, uh, but a couple little comments here and there. But mostly, no, it's been good. Oh, booze, like booze hisses. I thought you meant like yeah. alcohol booze. You're like no oh, real booze oh, till now. I'm like number one. I find that hard to believe. And number two, that's not what I asked. But either just just milk and juice yeah, and, and juice. straight yeah. edge bad, straight edge. Yeah, straight edge, for yeah. sure. That's yeah. it. All right. Uh, lastly, this is my jot note that doesn't make any sense. I wrote down policing. Does that make any oh, sense, yeah. anybody? Um. I went to high college for that's police. That's right. Yes. That's right. You're like a police guy yes. dropout. Yeah, I am a dropout. Okay, I'm a well, dropout cool. of everything. That's what's okay, buddy. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to wrap it up with this. Okay, you guys rode in on the A-team van. If memory serves, there were five guys That's right. in the A-team. I was just going to say, who would be B.A. Brackus? Because your band is called Low Level Flight. B.A. Brackus refused to fly. That would be you? Yep. That's and right. um, I got a modified hairstyle now yep. because um, the, the mohawk is played out. So do you pity fools on the tour too? I don't pity you anyone. Don't pity I fools, actually okay. just <laughs> demolition people. Even better. Yeah. I don't know what that means. Uh, who would you be, sir? We, who, who else was there? Murdoch? Uh, uh, I'm he's, Murdoch, he's baby. I'm howling mad, baby. Howling mad. Okay. Oh, boy. Uh, who else was there? We, we, we got three more to go real quick. Uh, uh, it was Murdoch, B.A. Brackus. I'm Hannibal, the leader, obviously. Hannibal, the leader. This is Face, the dumb, good-looking one. Yeah. <laughs> And uh, this is uh, the sister. Not a lot of people knew that, but the A-Team actually had a, a girl in it. Yeah. And um, 
she didn't develop till later in life, which is why Brandon's a little uh, flat-chested right now. But uh, he is the sister in the A-team. And the, and the facial hair is also yeah, in. from the hormone that's, he's taking to correct that. Yeah, yeah that's a definite uh, Brampton trait there, the mustache on the... Uh, Ladies, <laughs> keep, it, keep it going, keep it going. Yeah, uh, this isn't I'll... airing in Brampton, is it? <laughs> uh, what's next for you guys in uh, 2008? Uh, right now, actually, we're just working on a, a distribution deal in the U.S., so we'll probably be spending some time out there. And uh, we've already started writing. We've already started writing songs for the next record too. Yeah. So, cool. so like yeah. that dramatic. Yeah. 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 Awesome. That's what I bring. That's what I bring. Thank you so much, you guys. Yeah. Thanks a lot, Curtis, for having us, man. Absolutely. Yeah. Let's go where it's warm. Yes.